All right, hello everybody and welcome back. This is the third matchup today. You know the drill, round of 16 in the quarantine clash. Best of three, 16 star, no LBLJ tournament. And we have the eight seed Lysos versus the ninth seed Jaquarium. And with me in the booth is Zenry. Zenry, how are you doing today? And any thoughts on this matchup? I'm doing great. I actually am really excited for this matchup. Um, I haven't seen too much of Jaquarium, but Brett, or Lysos is always a... A really awesome runner really great streamer as well and considering that this is the eighth and ninth seed this is going to be just about as close as it can so i think we're in for a really good race here although lay sauce is the lower seed um or the better seed i don't know how to explicitly say it um he ranked better maybe that's how i phrase it uh jaquarium actually has pb since they were seeded so jaquarium has a 16 and uh lay sauce only has a 17 18. Very nice, and let's see what Jacarium does about Lakitu skip here. Nice little Lakitu skip. And, oh! Oh no. Uh oh. Oh no. And he's gonna go for the pole. I mean, at least this is a best of three. Brett Lysos has one game to throw away if he needs to. Oh, nice. Oh, Jacarium almost with really good movement there. I mean, still pretty good overall. Does he still do the double jump Alice? He's gonna go for it. And he's in. Nice double jump wow, Alice. That was tight. Now it's Brett's turn for his Alice, I'd imagine. Is he going for Alice? It looks like he might be actually taking the out. Looks like he's probably going for Alice now. Maybe he was just a little freaked out by his movement to the island the first time. Oh, God, that's rough. Not a good mistake. Oh, and tripping himself a little bit there, too. Let's see second try how he goes. That looks like it should work. Yeah, he's on there. Nice. That he did. Ooh, and Jaquarium out pretty early. I could have been a 442 perhaps, but with the bonk at the end, he exits at 445. Pretty solid pace for Jaquarium right now. I mean, Brett, what, 40 seconds behind right now? I mean, that's just a death. That's a death late in Dark World, to be fair. Brett going for the pro wall kicks will work. Looks like it did work. Ooh, Jaquarium burning himself Very there. Exciting. And missing the coin, so he can't get Chig anymore. That could be a little bit of time for uh, J Brett to get back, but he's going to need some more mistakes like that from Jaquarium. Usually when you don't get Chig Cycle, you go for Poverty Movement, but he still went to the island first. But this will be Normal Cycle if he hits it. Solid little Normal Cycle after messing up the beginning a little bit. Well, it looks like Brett's on pace for Normal Cycle too now. So it didn't quite get the time save he could have. And Jaquarium out, not at an awful pace. Oh no. Oh, we got the wrong death there. We got the wrong death there. I, I quite did he just bonk his head here? Oh, he bonked his head. Oof. Not too great of a death, sadly. Hopefully getting all his mistakes out now and just cleans it up rounds two and hopefully three. We always want to see it go to a best of three if possible, but Jaquarium probably does not want that to happen. And he's going to do his be very best not to let that happen. And I th believe Jaquarium does side hop. We'll find out if he goes for a top the pyramid first. Yeah, it looks like he's going to go for side hop. <sighs> Brett really struggling with Dark World. Oh no. Oh, no. I mean, that is just a brutal beginning for Brett. And let's see, Jaquarium. Side, side hop. Oh, Thirsty. That's going to hurt. He has two more chances with the lineup. Let's see if he knows the lineup as well. The setup. That'll work. That'll do. I mean, the good news for Brett is he's made so many mistakes that he might just be like, well, who cares what happens at this point? And sometimes having that attitude going into game two can help. Or he's tilted. Hopefully not tilted. We'll find out soon. It, I don't think we've seen a lead this much yet. A full basement ahead. I mean, that's what two deaths in Dark World are going to do for you. And Jaquarium struggling a lot with this Mips clip. Oh, wow. Brett's gotten almost a full two stars while he's been doing that Mips clip. Looks this like this one should one work, though. Jack, Jaquarium getting a little dust there. Going to be tight. I, it's going to be close if he can make the serious cycle. Ooh, nice wow. little comeback after a few little messes. <laughs> and Brett with a much cleaner Mips clip, at least, than uh, Jaquarium had, but sadly, Jaquarium already had that two-minute lead on him. Apparently, I have not turned alert sounds off, but thank you for the sub, Picnical. Jaquarium getting up into BLJs. <laughs> Can we get some uh, command BLJ? <laughs> I think we already got it, and it looks like it's going to work here. First time BLJ oh, there. Not bad at all. I mean, this is a pretty Thanks. solid performance from Jaquarium. Obviously, he would have liked to perform a little better at the beginning, but pretty promising going forward. Like, a 17 in a race gives you a good chance to win. Aaron Truett apparently taught Jaquarium BLJs this morning. Looks like it paid off. Ooh, missing the left side triple jump ball kick moving. And a pretty big fall. He's going to need a couple more of those for Brett to get back in it, though. 
pretty decent over one overall for Jacori, and Brett finally coming into BLJ. It's gonna take 10, 20 miss throws for Brett to have a chance here, but I mean, Brett can end on a note of confidence. He was playing better after Dark World. This one should work for Brett. It's gonna take a few BLJs. Let's see if he wants to commit to it, because sometimes you get scared, but nah, he knew it would work. Jacori missing short on his third and final. Ooh, could he burn himself and die? This sort of giving hope, very false hope, but some hope. And let's see if he can- It looks like that'll close it out here. though. He does. Could have definitely changed things, but... Uh, I mean, it ended up being a lot closer. If Brett did not have that Dark World melt meltdown, Brett may have won. And and that's got to be a sign of confidence for Brett. If he sees that uh, Jaquarium got an 1846 for his first run, Brett, all Brett thinks to himself, just don't die in Dark World. Forehead. Yep, <laughs> just don't die in Dark World, forehead. We hope it goes to game three. We have not had a game three yet. Although there's a, there's been four races and they've been mostly the bigger differences. So this is a good chance for a game three. Brett trying to like psych himself up right now. And to him another clean Lackadoo's get. Let's hope Brett can get it. I mean, if he gets it this time, it's already a lot better than the last race. And he's gotten it. And I mean, if he gets Lackadoo's skip for, or not like a uh, bomb clip first time too. A huge confident boost for Brett there. And Brett's going to get it. Probably made that Fair second backup on him. Yeah. I'm going for texture. Getting it. And getting it. Ooh, at least that's a little sloppy there. Probably going for out. Uh, oh, go. Okay. Going for Canalus first. Texture setup as well. Really hope he hits this. Solid. Oh, oh, he's not happy with that one. Yeah, let's see. Jaquarium's double jump Alice again. Ooh, Ooh missing, missing it there. It. Missing it. Not quite as much as a missed Canalus, but. It's still pretty good, and he's gonna go for the triple jump. And he's in. Okay, Jaquarium exiting a lot, lot worse than last time. Almost 20 full seconds worse than he did last time. 501 compared to his 445 last time. And let's see where Brett exits. And Brett with a nice penguin star, not getting all slippy on him. Yeah, still around 15, 16 lead for Jaquarium. And I mean, that's where Brett wants to be, especially compared to last race. Obviously, Dark World's coming up. Hopefully, he does not have a death here. Fingers crossed. Oh, Brett, no. We thought about this last race. If Brett had only died once, he would have had a chance to beat Jaquarium. So if Jaquarium maybe chokes a little at bits again, Brett can be right back in this. Oh, Jaquarium forgetting to get side. Is he going all the way back? Oh my goodness. That's pretty good for Brett. I personally just would have gone for swimming with the beast in the cavern, but apparently he might be more comfortable. No, he does 70 star. So a little weird that he didn't just go for beast in the cavern. Gonna go for side hop instead though. Yeah, and a little. That everyone in the chat was asking oh, Brett. So. Oh, that was a good chance for Brett to come back, too. Oh, oh, oh he saved it. it. Oh, well it. saved. <laughs> oh, those inputs. And Jaquarium a little better with his Mips clip this first time. And Brett just a Mips clip behind. Missing the second one. Talking to the door. Really wanted to see what it had to say about getting through there. And he's going to get normal cycle. That's some ground for Brett to make up as he bonks in. Oh. Oh, the bully, that would have been crazy if the bully pushed him off the edge there. Luckily avoids that. He should still be on pace for a normal cycle, though. Yeah. And he's going to go for this triple jump ball kick. Pretty nice. Um, I mean, Brett is a lot closer than he was last race. If Jaquarium has another bits meltdown, Brett can win this. Uh, first try BLJ for Jaquarium, though. Aaron Truitt's help really has been paying off for him. Jaquarium taking a little bit of time here. If Brett can get first time BLJ first one, he's on his tail. All right, looks like this one should be it. And he's through. That gives some breathing room for Brett. Or some room to close the gap. This one should work for Brett. Just behind. I mean, Jaquarium with another left side triple jump ball kick. Failure puts Brett tied if he gets his BLJ right now. Brett's in there. And Jaquarium, no problems this time though. It's going to take some throw missed throws to give Brett a chance or a mess up here at the end. But he's probably going to play it safe from here on out after he missed that first, uh, or after he missed the triple jump. Brett's still looking solid, though. Yeah, looking I mean, without that, again, that late Dark World death is actually the difference right now. Oh, and Jaquarium misses the first throw, but Brett missing the long jump over. Two missed throws, and it puts Brett close. And there's one. This should be an easier throw for, oh, that might be two missed. Oh, just hits to the side. Never mind. One throw for Jaquarium, and it should be over. Let's see if he can hit the last one. That looks like it's good hit unless it's short. No. Ugh. Jaquarium just getting out. Good games to Jaquarium. Good race. Uh, we're going to see if we can get Jaquarium in here. Laysauce is already on here. Brett, it was, a, it was sad to see both of those races. Uh, what were your thoughts throughout it? Uh, I just gave up mentally when I died in Dark World both times. Uh, very heartbreaking. Yeah, I mean, 
two on the eighth red coin too is just. Yeah. I I, I don't like, don't want to rub salt in the room, but just it must have really hurt mentally. Well, I think I overthought it after having you know the other tourney this week in Vol Volantis's and dying on Dark Worlds and just completely bombing there. So I uh, I, I think I just over overthought it, and unfortunately it did not. Uh, <laughs> It did not pan out the way I wanted it to. Jaquarium, uh, what were your thoughts on the race? You did well. Were you, I know you don't watch races, do you? You just play play it out and then see the result at the end? This time I did. And in that second race, I completely lost my focus. I left LOL with 11 stars and went to a toad that wasn't there and was absolutely just baffled. I had no idea what was going on. <laughs> Any final thoughts from you, Jaquarium? Oh, sorry, Brett. You can finish. I was just going to say, just beat GTM. That's just beat GTM. <laughs> yeah, Jaquarium is going against GTM. Uh, Jaquarium, any thoughts about that or any other final thoughts? What do you hear? Uh, I'm going to try. GTM says he gets nervous in races. So I'm going to try to get in his head, try to force him to go for Fly Guyless. <laughs> so uh, hopefully I'll have some sort of chance with that. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> all right. Thank you all and uh, have a good one. You good too. luck against GTM, right, Jaquarium. Yeah,